It's Monday night at the View House. The Rockies have the night off, but we sure don't. We are joined tonight by a Rockies analyst, a former Rockies player, and now a noted physicist who specializes in football inflation. How you doing, oh. my friend? Ryan Spielberg. It's good to see you, Vic. What do you think about Brady in this whole thing? What, what, what would the baseball equivalent to that be? Uh, you know what? It's hard to say because you've seen guys in the past with the nail file in the back yep. pocket, Charlie Huff. You, you've had different guys that have cheated the game. I think of George Brett with the pine tar uh -huh. incident. There's all kinds of different stuff. Obviously, steroids. You cannot deny the fact that it's been a, it's been a game that was plagued by steroids for a bunch of years. But I guess the equivalent of inflated balls or deflated balls would be <laughs> a nail file or, or somebody corking their bat. Yeah. Sammy Sosa Cork. corking exactly their bat. Right. Well, one thing we've learned about all the history of lying and cheating in sports, if you come out and admit it right away, people are sympathetic. Yes, Jason Giambi. It's he not got, hard. Yeah, he got popped with steroids. He came out and he said, I did it. Nobody cares about it that Jason Giambi did it. If you lie, if you point the finger, if you go in a grand jury and said, I did not take anything, they will scald you, and they should. Yeah. Brady's been playing this dance for five months, and that's why they got the Patriots today. All right. Let's